So in this video, I'm going to be showing you a solo merge glitch in GTA 5 Online after the patch of 1.69 and also the new update with the new Mercedes that just got it into GTA. Before we get into the video, quick shout out to my newest subscribers here on the channel and that is Mike. If you don't want to get a shout out just like Mike, all you got to do is subscribe to my YouTube channel, drop a like and you might get a shout out in my next video. Subscribing is free, it doesn't cost anything. And yeah, you might get a shout out. Also, let's try to reach 400 likes on this video. So the like goal for this video is going to be 400 likes. So everybody go drop a like on this video right now. It will be nice if we hit it. It does help out the channel a lot and it doesn't cost anything. Also, this method right here is going to be a solo merge. It's not going to be car to car since I already made a car to car merge about last week or like 10 days ago. So you can go watch that for car to car. This one is purely solo. You don't need anybody for it. So if anyone wonder why this one not car to car, it's because I already made one for the car to car on last week. But I will be making a video with all the solo merges in one video. So make sure you do click that red subscribe button that you don't miss it. So literally the red subscribe button, just click on it and you won't miss on all the solo merge glitches in one video. I'll make a video with all the solo merges. And yes, yeah, so make sure you don't mess with that. And I think I did say enough and let's get straight into the video. What you have to do is you need to bookmark this job in the description down below. So if you're on PlayStation, you're gonna have to bookmark the PlayStation one. And if you're on Xbox, you're gonna have to uh, bookmark the one for Xbox. You're gonna scroll right down here. Uh, by the way, for this right here, you don't actually, like you will need a donor card to transfer the mods to the cop car. But you could just use like a regular Benny car if you have Benny wheels and if you put that on any other car, it will be considered modern. So on PlayStation, it should be called Transform Cop. I'm not sure what it's going to be called on Xbox, but in the description down below, like I said, I will leave two links to it. So yeah, now you will start the job. This method is 100% solo, so you're not going to need anyone to actually do this. What time of day to noon? Um, I heard that like makes it like work, but I'm not sure. Just do it just in case. Um, I don't think it's necessary, but just in case, make sure you do do it. And now just like put the car that you want all the modifications to go to your cop car. So as you can see me, I have a lot of modded cars. Um, since I do live stream and uh, I do buy and sell with my subscribers. If you don't want to join, I'm probably live line right now, you know, um, you could do that. So as you can see, do load in. You don't have the modded cop car just yet. It is a bit glitched, but what you're going to have to do here once you do load in, you will have to go and wait the timer. And once the timer ran out, you're gonna have to drive through that checkpoint right there. And once you do, drove through the checkpoint, um, just oh, respawn. And once you've respawned, you will see that you do have your modded cop car. So it's definitely pretty cool. The only thing that is not permanent, it's only for this job. But around Friday, I will be making a video on how you can get this on the personal vehicle version. So make sure you click that red subscribe button. That way you don't miss it. It's literally the red subscribe button. Just click on it and that way you won't miss out. Uh, but this one, this method is pretty cool. It's solo. You don't need anyone for it. Uh, but yeah, I'll be making a method on Friday on hiking or either like next Friday on how you can get a modded, like your own modded cop car. Or you can watch my last video on the mer new merge glitch. So you can do the merge glitch with this or so merge. Um, uh, yeah, so it's definitely pretty cool. You can't actually, you can get out of your car if you set the race type to GTA. Uh, you can actually walk around. I forgot to do that. Um, but yeah, it's definitely pretty cool. You could like take pictures with your friends. You could like show your friends just be like, yo, I have a modded cop car. Yeah, they're probably not even gonna know how you got it, but it's definitely pretty cool. So the next merge I'm gonna be showing you is gonna be the car to RC. So you'll be able to get a modern RC Bandito with this next method and it will be permanent and you will be able to save it in an online session. And yeah, let's get straight to it. So the first thing which you're gonna have to do is make your way to your arena. And now very important, make sure you are in a public session. So if you're not in a public session, this method will not work. Let's work on all consoles, but if you're not in a public session, if you're like a friends only, this method is not gonna work. Also go to matchmaking and make sure you put it on closed. And by the way, I'll try to explain this method a bit easier since in my last video, I, a lot of people have questions. Um, make sure you also put graphics mode to fidelity if you're on new gen. And now once you've done those things, you're ready to go. So the first thing what you're gonna have to do is called Gerald. Yes, I finally pronounced it right. Literally the top comment on my last video was how I mispronounced this dude's name, Gerald. I think I finally said it right. So now, now the top comment should be, I finally pronounced it right, all right? Okay, but let's keep going. So you're gonna have to go into the workshop and obviously you're gonna have to request a job from Gerald. And now you're gonna have to change one thing on the car. So it doesn't matter, just the armor, whatever, just change one thing on the car. And then you're gonna have to exit the car. And now once you've done that, you're gonna have to walk up to the RC Bandito. And you're gonna have to walk up to it until you see the right on the d-pad modify your RC bandito then open your phone and you're gonna have to find the job right here from gerald and you're gonna have to hold options on your controller and then as soon as you 
as soon as you click X to enter the job, you're gonna have to let go of options. As you can see here, I messed it up. So it's not supposed to actually start the job. It's supposed to open options. So what you do is you hold options. So this part is a bit complicated. It took me quite a lot of tries. So you hold options and as soon as you click X, you let go of option. You can also try doing it the other way to where you let go of options and then you click X. But for most of the time that I got this glitch right is I clicked X and then I let go of options. So you hold options, you click X and then you let go of options. So I know a bit complicated. Uh, I'm not going to lie. This is probably one of the hardest merge glitches. So you might see some people say it doesn't work. It does work. It just takes a lot of tries. Um, so I did show a few tries here that I got. So if it keeps not working, you just change something on your car again. So now what you're going to have to do, so you just do that once again. So I just show you because I know most uh, tutorials show like how to get it right and they get it right the first time. So I'm going to show you. So I did show you how I actually didn't get it right. Now let me show you how what actually happens when you get it right. So so this this was the last try. This is where I actually got it right. So I'm just showing you this actually took quite a lot of tries. So don't think this will you will get it this first try. It took me quite a lot of tries. So look, you run up to the RC Bandito. You have to open your phone, go to Gerald, you hold the options, boom, see it worked. So you holding options, you click X, and as soon as you click X, you let go of options. Now go to Rockstar Created and start a tighten up a job. So if you did everything right, instead of starting up the job, the option menu will pop up. And now, if everything was done correctly, it should not say tighten up a job from Simeon, it should say tighten up a job from Gerald. As you can see, a tighten up a job from Gerald. Now back out of the mission, and as soon as you see the RC, you're gonna have to click right on the D-pad. Boom, you saw the mods transfer over. Do not spam right on the D-pad. You have to click it once as soon as you see the RC. And as you can see, now I got F1 wheels on my RC Bandito. And like I said, this method takes multiple tries. It's probably one of the hardest merges, so you might not get it the first try, but just keep trying and you will get it eventually, is what I did. So I think it took me like 10 tries. I'm not even gonna lie to you. This shit took me a while to make. and. Uh, yeah, but it does still work. One of my subscribers actually tested it out earlier. And this is older footage, but like I said, one of my subscribers already tested it out and it does still work. And yeah. And this is the end of the video. So I know some people will be upset that it's not car to car and there's not any car to car methods. But like I said, I'm not the one who comes up with the glitches. So hey man, I guess whoever is finding these can't find a solo car to car. But yeah, I'm not doing findings. I'm just showing you guys how to do them. So, um, I mean, guess if you're mad at me, I, I, I guess you could be mad at me. But like I said, I'm, I'm not doing finding these, all right? I'm just showing you all these. So, this is all the solo ones. So, yeah, if you did enjoy this video, make sure you drop a like on it. And like I said, here on the screen is going to be the car to car merge. And I'm pretty sure it still works after the update. And some of y'all might have to let me know. Uh, yeah, but make sure you don't miss out on next week's all working solo merges in one video. And I'll see you there. Peace.